Today is Thursday, September 4th, 2008. I had an orthodontist appointment today, and I thought maybe I was going to get my braces off because Dr. McNew had said I should get them off by September 11th, and today is September 4th. And last time I was there, he said that he probably could take off my braces and correct the rest of the trainers. Now, I didn't think my braces were ready to come off, and he looked at them and he said that they're not really ready. He will. He could take them off, but I told him, you know, I don't want you to take them off unless you were going to take them off anyway. Don't take them off prematurely just because I'm going to propose. So he put some crazy power chain and crazy stuff on. So, uh, yeah, there's all this pressure because this is where it's still messed up. So there's all this, like, pressure now and my teeth hurt. But I don't care. I told him, do whatever it takes. But now it sucks because if they were going to come off by September 11th, I would have seen Bonnie the weekend before her birthday, and then she would have seen me without braces. Now, the, they're coming off, I think, the 18th, so two days before I propose. So, what that means is when I propose, it'll be the first time Bonnie sees me without braces. So now I don't want to be like, you know, will you marry me? And her be like, where are your braces? That would suck. So hopefully uh, she won't be distracted by the fact that I don't have braces. Um, I heard from Leonore today. I have someone who can pick me up from the airport. So that's pretty awesome uh, when I go to Denver. And I talked to Bonnie's dad for a little bit. And he, you know, the vibe I'm getting is that they're not going to come. Hopefully once I go out there I can convince them to come. But um, I haven't talked to Bonnie's mom yet. Every time I call, I can never get through. Um, I'm also in the process of trying to get a hold of Bonnie's best friend out there, Elisa. Um, I called her earlier and left her a voicemail, but I haven't heard from her, and I have been unable to get a hold of her. But I would like to try to see her whenever I go out there and let her know what's up. That'd be cool. But um, other than that, I spent all day uploading more of these freaking stupid videos to YouTube. And Oh, and I called um, Mr. Burke today. This is exciting. And I asked uh, if it would be cool if I used the forest behind their house to propose. And he said, it's totally cool. He said that he didn't care how many people came. And I warned him there could be a lot. And he's totally cool with it. Um, I'm probably going to go over there Monday. And we're going to inspect the forest and try and figure out the best way for the dragon to get Bonnie in the forest. Um, to figure out how to rescue her and all that craziness. But I've got an official location now. So... This is officially happening at the forest behind Bridget's house, and uh, that Bridget's dad was even cool about maybe having like a cookout afterwards, because um, I don't know what I'm going to do after I propose, if there's going to be like, you know, 40, 50 people just standing around afterwards, and that could be weird. So yeah, so that was my crazy eventful day, and now I need to work on the script, because that's what should be priority one right now, but I just haven't done it so hopefully I'm about to work on that and get something accomplished so yeah